I would like to give you an insight into some of the work we're doing in the Moodles project. We work on improving and assessing the performance of a multimodal European transport system, enabling a seamless and hassle-free door-to-door journey for passengers with a strong focus on air and rail cooperation. We do this over a course of 30 months within a consortium of seven partners from five countries. And we have started working together in June 2020. We are from all over Europe and have backgrounds in air and rail transport, thus combining expertise in these different modal sectors. In our Modus project, we focus on three distinct pillars. First, we want to understand which factors drive demand for and supply of multimodal solutions. Then, we apply these factors to explore and model the interaction between air transport, ATM and other modes. Based on these results, we identify gaps and barriers in today's system and we want to formulate recommendations how we can move forward. To understand and assess future development path of the European transport system, one task within MODUS focuses on the depiction of scenarios. We derive these from European high-level mobility goals from different transport sectors. Each of these scenarios focuses on a particular aspect, which can actually have a significant impact on the shape of future mobility. Here you can see those four scenarios, which will be outlined in more detail in our upcoming deliverable D3.2. Looking at the scenarios in more detail, we see at first the pre-pandemic recovery scenario, which depicts the reference case and a situation which we saw before the COVID-19 pandemic. In the second scenario, we assume a large shift on short haul connections from air to rail. The third scenario exhibits very high growth rates of the transport sector, which is enabled by the widespread uptake of technological innovations. In the decentralized, remote and digital scenario, the European population is further dispersed, thus requiring the large scale connection of remote regions. Across these four scenarios, we want to inquire the impact for transport capacities or for door to door travel times, for example. Each of these scenarios is described by a multitude of fact factors that you can see here. These range from socioeconomic, environmental or political drivers to covering the mobility network, technological aspects or transport supply in general. If you would like to learn more about the scenarios and other parts of our work in Modus, please visit us on our website, via LinkedIn or on Twitter. We're very much looking forward to discussing these topics further with you. Thanks a lot for listening.